I didn't know you existed till his shadow grew smaller. Dipped in darkness, his tongue shifted so far east, you unpacked yourself legitimate behind his ego. Now you're a mouthful of worms multiplied by zero. I watched him dissect your atom, seen your speech shorten, your tongue harnessed. Once you were wayward woman pulling at dragon spines. Your burnt language used to flame him erect. Now the old ladies on 135th Street weave you into yesterday's tapestries. He called you lover this morning. But names like prior interests fuck your memories like bad prom pictures. Three years in, and now your apocalypse in high heels intangible. Touch Satan twice a day to break the monotony. Self-store your virginity in the angles of his back. His imprint fresh burning your flesh like bot skin grafts. And you recognize this feeling from memory. I mean, haven't you noticed? Haven't you noticed how his name tastes like genocide whenever you say it out loud? And as quickly as his mouth said, I love you, you offened your senses, laid down your defenses like American Indians in Confederate blankets, like Congo's 1800s, you accepted something that you unwillingly had no cure for and you didn't care. You refurbished pipe dream, tasting copper air, fending for anything that you come up with. But he's like music like music, like archangels in B minor, his stare would set the street ablaze, flamed pupils, broad nose inhaling cities. I mean, what you gonna do when angels can slip through heaven's fault lines or land in your insecurity all easy like that? I mean, I'm a dude and I was like, he's fucking awesome. But he's the worst kind of natural disaster. An earthquake in the belly of 10 Katrinas, misogyny wrapped in a rampage of torn ethos and gaseous ego, Oedipus on speed dial. He's quick to make you love his mother's mistakes. A rotten gospel of instant gratification. He said that you were the pot of gold at the end of his rainbow. Your back crossed this table bit so I could see you real quick. What if? What if he molds you a daughter that you gift to chaos? To a world without order? What would you teach her when your only satisfaction can be captured in the bell curve of a discarded condom? Maybe, maybe one day you'll awake on a knife's edge, the blade whispering that you could have avoided this as it ruptures your spleen into a thousand pieces of bloodied retrospect, or maybe, hopefully maybe, you'll awake in the eye of a hurricane. You will conjure Harriet Tubman, narcolepsy and all, and free your inner messiah, your voice box reclaimed. You are more than just what you scrape from the bottom of his occasional compliment, more than a vessel transporting his shame from those that provide judgment. Who are you? It's not compassion. It's not love. See, my love, this is much more than love foreseen four score ago. This is an Construction manual. Unconstructed, destructed, distracted, attracted to a night of estrogen burning off your morning. Sigh no more. Push night to day. And don't apologize for tracing his serenity. He clung hope from a mist of before. He licked your heart into a hill of tears, but now you must tear your flesh from this paradise of fairy tale landmines. Pull his linchpin tongue before he convinces you to give birth to grenades. Ask yourself, when he says, have my baby, ask yourself, what is the gestation period of atom bombs? Break away, reshape your spine, punch back, claw back, punch back, claw back, fight back, scratch back, kick back. Fuck that. You created him. So forget the death of this character. You can give birth to a proper man later. I need this for you. I want this for you. I need you to listen different. Because this poem is not really for you. It's for my daughter. In the hopes that the star left behind from her exploded resurrection will serve as her guiding light. And one day she comes to me and she says, Daddy, Daddy, why doesn't he love me the way that I love him? Then you'll remember that it's getting kind of late. It's got to be what, like close to eight? Well, you know, you're, you're late, you left the stove on and your cat's in heat, so that's just a fire hazard.